Well, if you have your Bible with you this morning, and even if you don't, you can find one in the seat pocket in front of you or on your row, most likely. Turn with me to 1 Corinthians chapter 12. 1 Corinthians chapter 12, we're taking our time through this chapter. There's a lot of meat here that has been good to chew on and to understand and digest. And this morning, our focus text is going to be verses 14 through 26. Verses 14 through 26. Join me once again in prayer. Our gracious God and Heavenly Father, we thank you from the bottom of our hearts for your most holy and living word. Lord, we thank you for your Spirit's work through it in our hearts. We thank you that it is living and powerful. We thank you, Lord God, that it shows us who we are. It shows us who you are shows us the Lord Jesus. It points us to him. It teaches us, it trains us, it corrects us in the ways of righteousness. O Lord, may our hearts and our minds be attentive to it now, that we would receive it and that we would do it. In Christ's name we pray these things. Amen. Well, 1 Corinthians chapter 12, beginning in verse 14, 